Hello and welcome to a Minecraft video. I'm Scudobuyo playing vanilla Minecraft 1.8.7 PC edition and this is just a quick video on how to build better animal pens or at least one way to do it. Um, yeah, you see this chicken here uh, is not moving and um, it's not really going to move for pretty much anything. Let me go ahead and get some seeds here. Yeah, it's um, it's identified that I have seeds, but it really isn't gonna. It, it can't follow me because it thinks it's trapped, uh, blocked in by these trap doors. Uh, it's not really that mobs think that trap doors are full blocks. Uh, you might uh, uh, read that or see that, um, uh, hear that elsewhere. Um, it's not it's that they really don't understand them on a more fundamental level than that. Uh, because this chicken could clearly jump up the one block height onto the edge of the trap door and, and follow me if it uh, really wanted to. It just doesn't understand that it can do that. So, uh, And um, this uh, little configuration here can be used to pretty much trap any kind of mob. Um, <laughs> pretty much uh, any passive mob, including villagers. Uh, this villager thinks it's trapped in there, it's not going to move. Uh, and if you can convince a hostile mob to reset its pathing behavior uh, while it's uh, on that spot, it will, uh, it will think it's stuck there also. Uh, and besides the uh, implications for creating uh, kind of interesting traps, uh, what I like to use this, uh, uh, this behavior for is to build uh, nicer looking animal pens uh, that drastically reduce the chance of animals uh, suffocating when the chunks are reloaded. Uh, so here you see uh, I've got eight cows in here and, and what happens is they, uh, they don't recognize that they can enter the space where this trap door is. So they walk towards the edge but they don't ever really try to walk onto that spot where the trap door is and so they kind of stop and every once in a while uh, one will kind of get pushed in there by the others. Um, but what it means is that um, they, uh, there's n they're never really trying to stick their heads into the sides of the block here uh, so, they, so that it's much less likely that they're going to get stuck. Um, and uh, I think that um, lining the uh, these pens with trap doors actually looks pretty nice. Uh, I've got some embedded glowstone in here. Make sure to corner off um, uh, the pen with some transparent blocks like glowstone or glass. Here I'm using glass. Um, and uh, and that's pretty much it. I, I like to use this uh, this design as um, for my animal pens. And uh, once I started doing this, it drastically reduced the number of uh, animal deaths that I had due to uh, due to random suffocation. Uh, and um, that's pretty much it for this video. Just a just a quick um, uh, quick note on um, uh, building this kind of thing, uh, using this behavior to build better animal pens. Uh, if you have any questions or suggestions, please do leave a note in the comments. And uh, thanks for watching.